Hey everybody, welcome back. Yeah, alright, it's about time to get back to hell mode here, so we're going to pick unknown. Uh, we're just going to leave all this the same. Put on some clothes here. And uh, because we are unknown, we will have access to thaumaturgy, so we're definitely going to want these prereqs here. What else could we get? Continuity 2 would be nice. We'll start working on that, and we already have Remise. Alright, so after we get Continuity 2, we'll work on maneuvering and armor. And of course, we'll start by learning Continuous Mind Sense. And uh, there's no specific plan for this run, you know, no specific weapon I'm looking for, or anything like that. Just a good old-fashioned, might we call it a vanilla hell mode run? Just to make things extra confusing. All right. Get rid of that. Pick up the torch. Let's get this upgrade sphere. And yeah, as usual, we'll just take the wood debris, put the nails in it as our first weapon. There's the hell mode credits and the Discord. Whoops, where you can get hell mode for yourself. See if we can get this guy knocked out before we get flanked. Well, that's not going to be the way to do it. That's better. A little too close. There you go. I was expecting to get flanked from that direction. That guy has not made his way down here yet. That's good. There he is as I'm trying to loot. Let's back it up. Whoops. Should have done a second overhead there, but I slashed. That's better. Okay. So, we're going to take this guy's gloves and his leather cap and his tunic for now. Uh, also, his hatchet, which is going to be better than this wood debris. And uh, we'll see this tunic. Eh. Eh. You know what? It's a tiny bit better. And we don't want to use the carpentry knife, just not that great. And way short. Okay, we're gonna get we're gonna get that aim fixed eventually. <laughs> Got closer. Okay, well thank you. I could have done that myself, but whatever. There it is. There we go. Alright, that's the woodcutter's axe. We need a hand to hold a torch, so we can't really use that axe right now. That coat is better than the tunic. These boots are not that great. Uh, let's see, thick padded cap is good. Gambeson will do for now. These are much better boots. And better quilted trousers. Now we'll take the waistcoat and these van braces. So not a bad haul right there. Alright, so, I mean, we'll just take this for a secondary, this bill hook here. As I was saying before, we're not going to really be able to use it anytime soon. Alright. Decent and great condition. Ours is... Whoops. Uh, decent in good condition. This one has more impact. I'm going to switch this out. Way too short. There we are. Alright, don't want any of that stuff. Uh, I think I dropped something. I'm going to just go look on the floor real quick. That was not a face plant. I was just looking for something. There we go. Not the cleanest overhead there at the end, but it worked. Take that belt. Alright. 
Let's compare these real quick. Yeah, that's better. Well, but this is high quality, and I'd rather hold on to the high quality one, to be honest. These are some better van braces. Yeah. Don't want that hatchet. And we got all three of their attention at once. They're still standing a little too far back. Yeah. There we go. Thought I could catch her right there. Good on that, I don't want her broom. No. Still too far away. There we go. Okay, so that's not as good as the vest we already picked up. It's a better coat though. Getting those, not getting the right angle with the blade there. That's better. All right, Spalders. That will do. Over here and grab the compass. right behind the door? No. Very nice. And let's see, this is a better vest. I think I'm going to stick with the bill hook as our currently unused secondary option. Oh, I didn't expect him to get his hand free. Or her hand free, as the case may be. Uh, no, we're good on all that. There's a long knife in there, but I'm not interested in that right now. We're just going to hold on to the hatchet. I don't want to have to readjust once again to a different reach on the weapon, only to change the long knife soon anyway. So I'm just going to stick with the hatchet until I get a uh, one-handed bill hook, which won't take very long. Dang. Oh, this is bad. All right, let's back up here. Thank you for the help. Nope. Yeah, this, they're going to end up doing all the killing for me. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, I don't mind.
Dang. Forgot I don't have the repost skill. stuff for now also you know what let's go around this way ah oh, cheesy took our first red damage already just because I wanted to slash just to change things up should have just stuck with the overheads Now we're about to get that one-handed bill hook. There it is. So, what quality? Mediocre, reasonable condition. Alright. Dang. There we go. Oh, whoops. Take that half sav. Yeah, I don't need that jacket. So many friendly fire kills so far. Okay. Alright, it's time to fight the mini boss skeleton guy who is a total pain. Usually, anyway. Let him get in close with that dagger. Alright. Hey, that went surprisingly well. Once again, that's like twice now he has not gotten red damage on us, which he used to do. Literally every run. So that's good. Grab the key. Let's see how much... Now, you don't get any crush with this. That's the tragedy. That's why I'll probably be switching to a spiked club pretty soon. Uh, now we, we have 
better spalders. Whoa. Didn't seem. <laughs> Yet another friendly fire kill. I love it. There's a spiked club. Hopefully it's decent. Uh, let's see. Well, it's not terrible. I would like more than a half circle of crush damage, but that's okay. cap. Yeah, we're just going to take it. And anything here? Yep. Some decent boots. Alright. Nothing too crazy, but a step up indeed. It's time to pick up everyone's favorite traitor, Baron. He will eventually turn on you no matter what you do, but in the meantime, you know, you have a little bit of help. Even though he does get in the way and probably does more harm than good, I, you know, in the end, I don't know. Yep. Alright, let's be on our way. Dang it. Come on, man. Right on to the next obstacle. So we're making our way back towards the beginning of the level, where there are some locked doors. Oh good, for which we now have the key. And we took some serious environmental damage with that face plant right there, man. Make sure he catches up. Alright. Double click the key, single click the door, now it's unlocked. I don't mind putting Baron in harm's way. Swung from the wrong direction. Alright, we've learned continuous mind sense, and uh, now we're going to work on calm. Uh, whoops, I didn't cast it. What? Oh. I keep. What are you doing, man? What? Baron is already the enemy? All I was doing was trying to cast my continuous mind sense spell and he starts attacking. Is he still hostile? Finally cast it. I don't know why I wouldn't cast it before. 
Oh yeah, alright, bring it on, man. It usually does not turn on you this soon. <laughs> He's a tricky one, too. Taking uh, quite the beating. And he's probably not dead, he's probably just knocked out. And that's obviously unacceptable. So, we need to make sure that we kill him. Yep, see, look at that. We're not getting him with the spikes on the club. I think we may have gotten him. Alright, so this is going to be where we end this episode. Thank you, as always, for hanging out, everybody. I appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe if you'd like to. And I will see you all next time. I think he's dead.